Students at Oklahoma State are conducting research on a global scale. One student helped design and build something that will help detect radiation in the atmosphere. Jordan Fremstead tells us how they've launched their work to new heights. Being a problem solver is probably one of the best qualities you could have. At Oklahoma State, solutions require knowledge of what's hidden. That's a good example of problem solving. <laughs> Tristan Lee is an OSU physics PhD candidate. I've just lived a, a large part of my life here. Who knows the only way to solve problems is to recognize they exist. But I didn't know that I'd be doing stuff quite as uh, out of this world like this. My research group is all about radiation. Physics professor Eric Benton. The plastic here basically simulates the, the tissue of the human body. Has spent the better part of two decades studying radiation in the atmosphere. Supernova, the sun, other stars spit out high energy particles. He says the atmosphere protects us on the ground. It's relatively safe here. But the higher you go, the less protection. We know that radiation can lead to harmful things like increases in cancer. Pilots and astronauts are at a greater risk. Whenever I built Space Ted, I built two of them, and this is the second one. Yeah. Tristan designed this space tissue equivalent dosimeter, or Space Ted. It works. Simple on the outside. And all you have to do is flip a power switch. But it gathers complicated radiation data on the inside. Basically has the same sensitivity to radiation as human tissue does. Their device is already collecting data on the International Space Station. It went up on a SpaceX Falcon 9 rocket. Ignition, lift off. We get data once every two weeks. Tristan receives the data in an email, and then it's up to him to make sense of it. Yeah, that's the physics part of it. Protecting people is possible when we see what's hidden. I will be prepared to take on even bigger things. It takes people with knowledge from the past. To try to understand this, measure it more accurately. In the future. And the future looks pretty bright. To help the rest of us prepare for what lies ahead. Then it all comes together at the end. In Stillwater, Jordan Fremstead, Oklahoma Zone, News 9.